Who says the terminal has to be boring? With boxes, you can surround your text with boxes. We'll show you how after the intro. Okay, this is a very quick uh, install. It's a very small program. So you do pkg install boxes. And just press yes. And boom, done. Um, and that was incredibly quick. Well, what can it do? Without sort of like spoiling it for you and the clues in the name, it draws boxes around your text in the terminal. So I'm just going to change to a nice green X term theme. Zoom in a little bit. And I've already prepared a small text file to use as an example. So if I cat boxes intro, and there are. It says, in this video, we'll be looking at boxes. How exciting. With a couple of spaces above and below. You can, of course, put other messages, or it could be some information about a program. It could be anything, really. Or something that you would perhaps want to copy and paste in the, in the chat section. The basic use of boxes is, if you just put the standard command, boxes, then not followed by any switches, and then just put the text file that you want to be displayed, it will, by default, use this pretty neat little asterisk and uh, forward slash pattern. No, but it does other things other than this. And there's quite a few already built in uh, patterns. So if you put boxes hyphen L, and that will list all the available uh, patterns to use. And you can do a nice circle one, a uh, nice and whirly one, ones that look like Vim, unicorn, say, underlines. So there's quite a few available. Um, some more sophisticated than others by the looks of this one. So what you need to do is you just find out the name of the particular one that you want to use. You do boxes hyphen D, say for instance one that's called boy, and then your text file, and there you go. So that's pretty neat. I mean, it's, it's simple, but it's kind of fun. There are quite a few uh, options for boxes. You can format you know, alignment and positioning, um, very basic shapes, box design name, configuration files, and you just do, you know, just if you want to add padding and size of the box, and, and it's just little things like that. But overall, this is, um, you know, a kind of pretty use, useless uh, program, but it's something that I found the other day, and I thought it was just fun to share it. Now, some of the things that you can do in the FreeBS terminal is, uh, is quite fun. Anyway, Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.